Hi guys! It's KLKS Knowledge Learned Knowledge Shared Gusto mo bang makapasa sa Microsoft Office Specialist online examination mo para sa Microsoft Excel? If your answer is yes Watch the start till the end of my tutorial video and I assure you, you will pass your online exam. KLKS na tayo! How to become Microsoft Office Specialist in Excel 2016? Paano nga ba makapasa sa Microsoft Excel 2016 online exam? Today, I will be your guide for our review in our Microsoft Office Specialist Excel in 2016. I subdivided my topic into two parts. The first part, the overview, wherein I will be sharing some of the coverage of your Microsoft Excel 2016 exam. And the second part is all about the demonstration, wherein I will going to demonstrate the part of the coverage that I discussed during your overview. Let's start with our objective for today. Today, our first objective is to pass the Microsoft Office Excel 2016 online exam. We have also to familiarize Microsoft Excel basic manipulation. We have to execute Microsoft Excel basic formulas. And we have to manipulate basic functionality of Excel. Let's start with our journey on how to pass the Microsoft Office Online Certification in Excel 2016. So, how to get Microsoft Office Specialist Certification? We have to learn, to practice, and be certified. So, the first thing you must identify are the basic manipulation using Excel, the basic formula for Excel and the basic functionality for our Microsoft X 2016 and be certified. So the first part of our review is all about Microsoft Excel basic manipulation. For our basic functionality, we will be using the Microsoft Excel images, Microsoft Excel Sparkline. Also, as a part of functionality, we will be using Microsoft Excel Hyperlink. As a part of our functionality, we do have Microsoft Excel Sorting. Sorting. Another part of our basic functionality is all about the Microsoft Excel table. We do have also the Microsoft Excel chart. Okay, so we do have also the print setup for basic functionality. And the last part of our basic functionality is all about the Microsoft Excel file import. Thank you and good luck on your examination. Let's start now with our tutorial demonstration. Our topic is all about the Microsoft Office Review Tutorial for Microsoft Excel 2016 Basic Manipulation. So the first thing we must do is to familiarize ourselves with the worksheet that we have. We do have the product worksheet and the customer worksheet. So let's start with our task number one. Create a new worksheet name template. By simply pointing your mouse on the plus sign, you do have the new sheet. So click the new sheet, type the name of the new worksheet. Copy the worksheet product at the right of the worksheet customer. So I am now with my worksheet product. So right click my mouse. Then copy move or copy then click the box create a copy so it must be at the right of the customer 
So I will be clicking on the template. Rename the worksheet customer to client by order. Click on the customer, then right-click my mouse, then rename. Client by order, then proceed with A21 till E25. So the best way to do is to go on our name box. So I have here now my name box. So all I have to do is to type the set. So what is the reason? The easiest way to select a particular cells. All you have to do is to use your name box. Then press enter. Locating my cell at A2, then press Ctrl B. Let's open record one. Then all you have to do is to click on the column E using the cost add header. Okay, then menu bar home. Then find and select. Then replace. Records one. So on go one, two, and three. Right click your mouse. Hide. Record or worksheet record two. Right click your mouse. Hide. Then right click your mouse. So you have to look for the tab color. And on the tab. So machine. Machine number 3, change the row height, so go to the format, then row height, so make it 30, then okay, number 1, the sync number 1, so I do have now the name on the right, so right click your mouse. Using present number 2, formatting tool to highlight every other row. So click on any part of the table, then go on the design, then click banded tool. Okay, so next in line. So let us go now with... Still on the present number 2. So let us try to have a one column for present number 2. So highlight B8 until H1 then proceed with merge and center use it as a cross okay sort and filter then custom sort All you have to do is to highlight the needed cells. Okay. Then go on the format as table. Then choose the needed style, table style medium 9. Okay. Then click. Okay. Then name the table as others. Page three, then print titles, then 
go on the room calling select room Our product on click anywhere then go in the data so then remove the defects then unselect Add the pitch layout then margin custom margin so you have to use one Team images, so all you have to do is to go on at the top, please. So insert picture, filter, just to highlight, go to the conditional formatting, then. All you have to do is to click on any of the cell. So go, uh, go, go on the design, then convert to image. So converting to image. So using customer, so go on the total, then go on the wrap text. So it will come up with two names our product then followed by file then so open the worksheet sales then go to F3 then That's all for part 1. So we will continue. For our part 2, we will concentrate on creating formulas and drafts. Thank you for watching. Hope you learned something.